And then finally, a call between McCarthy and Trump. Tell us about it. Was it like a wellness check or like <laughs> what, what are we talking about? That's actually a good question and that we weren't totally able to get to the bottom uh. to about exactly why they were speaking. We were told it was sort of a routine checkup. Post <laughs> <We're to check laughs> <Okay>. McCarthy. <laughs> he they, was making sure the burgers were being delivered yeah. on time. That they both have jobs to do despite McCarthy being ousted from the Speaker's um, seat. But that in the course of that call, Trump expressed to McCarthy why exactly he declined to get people like Matt Gates and these other hardline Republicans off of his back and, and back down from their uh, plan to remove him from the speakership by pushing forward this motion to vacate. Uh, Trump said that McCarthy was essentially insufficiently loyal, didn't endorse him, uh, didn't c bring to the floor to um, these, these two bills that Trump wanted to expunge his impeachment inquiries. McCarthy, in recollections about these conversations to other people after the fact, claimed that he told Trump to, uh, he said, F you. He has said this before. This is a, a very oh, similar please. McCarthy story that we've right. heard, sort of the discrepancies okay. between his recollections of his private conversation with Trump versus what he actually said. McCarthy's people said he didn't curse him out. No. We've didn't. talked to people who said <laughs> have. Ed, this is, this is an ongoing oh, routine God. by Kevin McCarthy, who claims to third parties that he shouted, screamed and shouted at Donald Trump. and. And, and told him to blank off, and you yelled at him on January 6th, you don't F with me, you know exactly who these people, et cetera, et cetera. And it, I don't know, it never squares up. We never hear him saying that publicly, never hear him talking. If he talks stuff about Trump, he backs down the next day. Goes to visit him. So I, I don't believe a word of it. I mean, I'm very excited hey, thank by you. The, exactly. the risk here. <laughs> Using terms like F you, we're getting very close to the edge. Yes, yes. But I don't, I don't believe a word of it either. I don't believe a word. Um, I, I, you know, I can believe Liz Cheney saying F you to all yeah, yeah. exactly. people and then oh, deserving yeah. it fully. Mm -hmm. um, but McCarthy to Trump. No, George Santos is likelier to be to have a truthful resume <laughs> yeah. than, than that to be true. The, the best thing said, one of the best things said on January 6th, speaking of Liz Cheney, was when uh, a certain member of the, of the Republican Congress, well, Jim Jordan, put his, his, his hand, hand, our hand on her arm to help her, and she goes, get your hand off of me. You're responsible you for this. this. Yeah. You did this. You did this. All right. The Washington Post, Jackie Alamany. Thank you very thank you, much. Jackie. Good to see Happy you. Friday. Thanks, Great guys. Reporting. Thank you for all the, the pop culture references. Yeah. It helps us. Anytime. Helps our cred a great deal. All right. Coming.